This is Brett Waltemath of Starwatch Media here at the Step Up Women's Network Red Carpet Benefit in Los Angeles, California. Brett with Starwatch Media, it's a pleasure to speak with you. We're supporting a wonderful organization this, this evening, the Step Up Women's Network. How's it feel to be here and be supporting? It feels wonderful. I couldn't be more happy to support this wonderful cause for young women and empowerment for women. I mean, I've been waiting for a cause like this, so I couldn't be happier. And such a great cause that not only mentors young women, but also uh, creates a, a social network for them to help build their careers. Absolutely. And I feel like in a world as, as we live right now with empowering women, women who are older being able to really mentor younger women is the most important thing ever especially in these rough times in school and whatnot sometimes it's a little bit hard to understand you know where you want to go what path you want to take in life and i think that it's really important for those women who are strong and have been there before to mentor the younger women so uh, what are some of your current projects do you are you currently working on an album are you touring yes i have an album right now on itunes it's called came to play I've been on a 50 city nationwide tour of uh, Canada and also our nation. And um, I also sing the national anthem, so I'm kind of known as like the anthem girl around town. I sing it all over for every single team in LA. But my music is on iTunes and I'm currently performing pretty much everywhere. And one of the most important songs for this particular event is called Change the World. And it's, you know, coming together, holding hands, and just changing the world one step at a time. What was your inspiration behind the song? The song was, that's a very good question because it was actually geared toward young women. You know, I always thought about being in high school and like the mean girls passing by and I always thought instead of them being mean, if they could just flash a smile and we could all come together somehow, you know, really come together. Um, you know, just giving that smile and coming hand in hand, it was all of that coming together and I thought that that would be something good for the youth to adhere to in order to, you know, get up and actually make a change. Uh, with the album, can you please discuss a little bit about the album and your inspiration behind the album? Sure. The album is very old Hollywood meets new. Uh, a lot of, uh, I felt like a lot of females nowadays I take the very masculine approach right now. So I kind of wanted to do something different and bring back the feminine appeal and the feminine approach. So it's, it's very like, it's girly but it's also very confident and it's got that edge to it. You know, the songs really talk about being yourself and being gorgeous and owning it and in, in a proper, respectable way, you know. What musicians have been your greatest influence uh, as an aspiring musician? That's a good question. I grew up uh, listening to Mariah Carey. I do the big ballads. So Mariah Carey, Celine Dion. I like artists who have a uh, stretch in their, in their projects, you know, that can go from, you know, having the upbeat songs to having the slow ballads and being able to add real meaning, you know, behind songs and words. Thank you so much for the time and enjoy the evening. Enjoy the, enjoy the holiday season. Absolutely, I will. And you guys can check me out at roxydar.com if you want to get more on my album and just become a fan. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.